Run the code online or download from codegive.com, link in the description below. Sure. The drop function in Python is commonly used in libraries like Pandas, which is widely used for data manipulation and analysis. The drop function is specifically used to remove rows or columns from a data frame based on their labels or positions. Let's dive into a tutorial on how to use the drop function with pandas in Python. Firstly, ensure you have pandas installed. You can install it via pip if you haven't already. After installation, import the pandas library into your Python script. Let's create a sample data frame to work with. This will give you the following data frame. Now, let's use the drop function to remove specific rows or columns from the data frame. The basic syntax for dropping is as follows. Let's see some examples. To drop specific rows, you need to specify the row labels and set axis equals zero, or simply omit it as axis equals zero is the default. This will give you the data frame with the first row removed. To drop specific columns, specify the column labels and set axis equals one. This will give you the data frame with column B removed. In this tutorial, you learned how to use the drop function in Python with pandas to remove rows or columns from a data frame. This functionality is useful for data manipulation and cleaning tasks in data analysis projects. Experiment with different parameters and options to get comfortable with using the drop function effectively. ChatGPT